So Miyopi, I see we have some old equipment here. What's going on here? Uh, Etienne, what we're going to show today is what's happening. You've got a two, two discs being been worn out, is out of the limits. We've got certain measurements on that. The new one is 380 millimeters and the old one is 365. So how are you going to happen? You can see this little guide of your seat tube should be a, got a little bit play. And if you're going to put your seat tube inside here, you can see going to happen. Your seat tube st stacking out. So your ground and all that thing will uh, touch your seat tube and then you will get damage on your seat tube. And that will influence your singulation. And the very important thing is, if you're gonna see these two business cards, the gap between them should be 50 millimeters. And this is not right. So what's gonna happen, it's not gonna open your, we was talking about the true V by opening the side walls and that will influence your side walls and that will only give you the, the, the right depth of your, of your seat. So how do we set this right? To set it right, you've got spaces inside there, you've got a little bit of shims here, and you can put shims on the left and the right side. So that's very important. If you're gonna put the shims in, if you put six on that side, you must also put six on that side. So that doesn't mean pain you put only on one side, then you also lock this thing. You can't, can't lock in. So to put new discs on, we must un unscrew it, put new discs in, then we can do the adjustment over on that. We got two new discs and we're gonna put it on to see how to do Let's that. do it. So Miopi, here we've got a brand new set of coaters that we've just put on. How do we know that it's set right? It then, you start measuring by two, putting two business cards in, and then you measure between the two business cards and should be 50 millimeters. Uh, normally, I'm going to use it by turning it at three different positions to make sure your spacing is, is right. So if you're going to put it and you can mark it and you turn it and measure it at three different positions, then you know your shims are right and you can see also here, this thing is loose and it's not sticking out here. And now you know your true V is being set up. 